A Little Rock church left with a thousand dollar bill after vandals strike their place of worship. Thanks so much for joining us for Fox 16 News at 9. I'm Jessica Rank and I'm Gary Burton Jr. Mapleville Methodist Church was vandalized sometime between Sunday and Tuesday last week. The damage left behind is coming at a pretty hefty price. Whitney Thomas spoke with church leaders. Whitney, tell us about the damage. Church leaders are distraught after finding their church hall flooded with over six inches of water Tuesday morning. They say it's devastating to think that anyone would want to ruin their facility, and they're hoping that the person who did it eventually comes forward. It was just unspeakable. I thought, why would somebody deface the church? Brenda McCann, I mean, you know, describing the moment she found Mabelville Methodist Church Life Center flooded Tuesday morning. I noticed the floor kind of looked funny and I didn't think anything and then I walked, started walking over to the room, sewing room where everything is kept and walked into water. The facility left vandalized and flooded with more than three inches of water. It broke McCann's heart. The hose in the janitor's closet was sticking straight up out of the sink, which it never does that. It was intentional. Church leaders believe whoever did this came in and left the faucet running overnight, damaging multiple rooms and ruining over a thousand dollars worth of items. The fans still running to dry the floors. The, the tiles were coming up and I was trying to put them back down. Pastor Bob Marble says there's more water to be pumped out and he's left wondering why someone would do this. And there may have been just coming to see what was in the church and when they didn't find anything, they said, OK, let's just see what we can do. So I don't know. It's it's a tragic situation. Marble says it could take weeks to reopen and replace what's been damaged, and he's moving forward aware and hopeful. It's it's life today. I mean, there's a there's a lot of people that just don't like the church. Right? And so I don't know if that was the type of individual we had or if it was just vandalism. Mabelville church leaders are asking that if anyone knows or has seen anything that they reach out to them or call the police. Reporting Whitney Thomas, Fox 16 News. Whitney, thank you very much.